This is a reading of Brenda's blog titled, Honesty is the New Social Game. Dear ones, your need to be the shining light of your environments, friends, and family was important in 3D, but is no longer. You are now shining from the inside out instead of the outside in. Most of your 3D life was thinking or stating, look at me, aren't I special? Perhaps you object to that last thought, believing you are shy or introverted, so you never try to grab attention. We beg to differ. Even though you are an introvert, you required approval from family, teachers, friends, lovers, co-workers, and supervisors. 3D society is based on outer approval. Am I my parents' favorite? Do the neighborhood kids like me? Am I lovable? Does my supervisor like me enough to promote me? Do my kids even like me? <laughs> and on and on throughout your 3D life. Thoughts that encouraged you to be who others needed you to be. Whether you were an introvert or extrovert. The 3D social spectrum needed affirmation from others in ways you probably have difficulties remembering now that you are in the midst of your new you transition. In 3D, you performed. In your new world, you exist. It no longer matters how popular you were or are. You are on a unique path in a unique time. Others you once performed for are not that important to you. And those concerned about how little you are now adding to their lives are likely moving to new relationships. There's no need for you to perform. Doing so will confuse others. Just as you are discovering new you, so are they. In that discovery process, all of you are discovering an honesty antenna. The old social games are outdated. The new social game is honesty. Who are you is becoming as important to others as it is to you. The new interactions you find interesting enough to maintain are based on your inner truth instead of inner shoulds. Because of your 3D need to be loved, respected, and accepted by others, you jumped through emotional hoops that may or may not have been who you wanted to be. Those hoops have been removed so your interests needs and companions are no longer forged by your need to belong. The 3D social games are over. Some might play these 3D games for a while because doing so is expected or comfortable. Even so, those of you enmeshed in your new being will no longer be interested, much as an older sibling is not interested in their younger sibling's toys. The need to please is over. Your new need is to honor your feelings, your being. We of the universes have previously discussed your 3D need to please others. But when we did so, you were not necessarily aware of how many of your daily actions were dedicated to ensuring others loved or respected you. Now that those heavy 3D burdens are lifting, you're discovering how different you are from who you once thought you were. Even the new segments you added to your former 3D being were selected to highlight who you truly are, instead of changing you. The uniqueness you enhanced by adventures through the universes for eons is finally shining brightly in this new world. New you is your truth, not society's truth as happened in 3D. For most of you, it doesn't matter if this person or that cares for you. It is a revelation as surprising to you as those you once catered to, hoping they would accept you in whatever form you needed. Catering to anyone is becoming almost abhorrent to you forerunners. In your workplace, you did this and this because you needed or wanted the job. Now that you have had downtime to review your needs you're finding it difficult to jump through those hoops. You want the freedom to be. 
such as difficult, if not impossible, in a 3D environment. So it is you're saying goodbye to conformity, as much as you dare. And hello to the creativity of freedom. Of course, our flippant remarks do not pay your rent nor buy your food. But as you claim your new being, you will discover you do not care as much as you once did to conform or perform. You are not a trained seal as 3D society encouraged, even forced you to be. In 3D, you're born, you attend school, you work, you create love relationships that most often produce children who you hope care enough about you to care for you in old age, and then you die. All the while depending on others to love, entertain, pay for your life, and care for you. Even though not everyone creates that 3D life model, it is the goal of 3D children. The new developing you is more like, this is who I am and what I'm interested in. I hope I find someone with similar interests because that would make my life more fun. But if I don't, it doesn't matter because my days are filled with my interests. You are the new model. You are the shimmering, shining example of what is possible. Even expected of every being entering Earth from now on. You are new, as are your expectations of those who wish to transition. No longer is there a need to say this or that to attract others, whether it be playmates, employers, lovers, or even your children. You are you in all your glory, never again to return to pleasing others as you have done for 3D Earth eons. You are free, and so is everyone. So be it. Amen.